Now, how do I add additional emojis? First of all, you'd have to have the pencil box selected. I clicked on it and it puts the little four dots in the corner so that I've got that selected. Now I've got the emojis over here and there's different ones that are in here, but how do you add your own? You click on the pencil on the right and it opens up this window saying, okay, here's emojis. Well, I want to add create stickers. And this is where I would put in my icons, my icons, or whatever you want to call it. Okay? You name it. Now, from in my icons, you have to go find the folder that you're going to select it from. Well, I got a folder in here someplace called backgrounds. And uh, let's see, what was that called? Uh, Spark Art. Let's go into the Spark Art folder. And I'm going to select a bunch of different things in here that we're going to use. Like, let's use some butterflies. I want to select that butterfly. And I want to add another one. Another butterfly. And add another butterfly. Right there. So I add three butterflies. Let me add... Uh, how about one more butterfly over here? Let's add some hearts. How about this heart right here? And let's add another heart right here. And let's add another... Uh, let's go to this gift. And add another gift. Okay. Now let's add some glasses. I think I had some glasses in here. Here's some glasses. We'll add these glasses. Okay, let's add another glasses. How about these glasses right here? Okay, and add another one. And add those glasses right there. And I'm going to scroll it down so you can see the glasses are being added. Now I'm going to look for, uh, let's see, uh, I got some little, uh, little boxes that we can write text on. I'm going to put some of those in there. Grab a few of those. Let's grab that one. Let's grab that one. I'm just going to grab a few of those to show you how well you can actually add your own. And then once I'm done, I'm going to hit close. So I now have a new listing called My Icons. Okay, and I'm selecting that one. So now when I go out, I'm going to pause it here. Okay, now I said I'm going to go out and I'm going to pause it there. And, and now I'm going to zoom in a little bit and let me tilt myself so that I can get a little bit more of me on the screen. Okay, now I'm going to start this session, and we're going to do the same thing as you yeah, saw in right. the other other video, but this one here is going Nine, to have uh, four, a little bit different, because we're going to have two, different icons. One. Here's the first picture. Uh, again, let's uh, let's get a hat Smile. or something to put on as a... Five, four, three, two, one. Yeah, I do look a little bit better with one glasses more. on. A little better with glasses on, Five, four, but I'm a little bit more three, evil. Two, one. Okay. Be now, late. now that that's done, that it's going to bring it up and <coughs> have me sign my photo. As before, we did all the signing before, and now you'll see that that butterfly is my emojis. So now, when I click on the emojis, these are the ones that I added. And remember I said this one here? I could actually put a bubble thing right here. Oh, I'm going to undo that because it didn't place it where I really wanted it. Let me use this other bubble going on the other side. And I'm going to place it right here. So it's going to look like I'm talking. So now when I want to type boo, I can write on the screen boo in my box up here. Okay? But the other emoji icons, uh, let's put some glasses on this guy. I like those glasses right there. Oh, it's a little bit too big. Let me undo that. Let me find some glasses that might be a little smaller. I'll put them right between my eyes. Yeah, there we go. I got some glasses on this goofy guy. And you can pick anything you want. I really love this one right here. Okay? So that's how you do it. Drawing on the screen the same as before. This is me. And I'm signing it with my crumbly finger. Anything you want to do, you undo. And that's how it's done. Click OK. It will finish up showing you the preview of the three photos as it did before. 
and it's assembling the GIF because I apparently had it set up to do a GIF and now here's the three photos they do not have any of those graphics at all because these are the original saved so uh, the, the original single fo photos but my layout has all of the graphics built right in and that's pretty much you. how it's done bye